Hey guys, welcome back to Vampy TV. Guys, if you're new here, please to like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy things about religion and if you want to know about Islamic and Christian. If you want to know about the religion, really well, I'm going through this journey. And if you are willing to stay here with me, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. Guys, today we're going to be reacting to a Christian priest says Christianity can never be as good as Islam. This sounds strange because if you know it isn't going to be as good as Islam, why are you still a Christian? You see, we, I feel one thing about us Christians that, no way, let's go in the video then, I'll feel the tale. But let's get straight into this. I keep hearing people say, hey, Christians need to be in power. Christians need to do this, sir. Is it with this kind of Christianity? With this kind of Christianity is when we'll be in power. A Christianity that is lame, a Christianity that is weak. You think, sir, when we were on the other side, let me tell you first of all the physical side before we do the, spirit, the spiritual side. When we were on the other side, there is, there, is, there is a statement. It's simple. You go anywhere, they tell you, Al Muslim, Akul Muslim. Anywhere you go to, they will tell you a Muslim is the brother of a Muslim. I have shared with you here a terrible thing. I hate sharing it. I was sent by the Archbishop somewhere and I got stranded on the way. I went to a church to go and tell them that they should, I, I want to spend the night there. I heard the pastor and the wife arguing inside. I told them, I said, look, I will not sleep in your house. I want to sleep in the church. Sir, they didn't allow me. I left that place and walked to a mosque. I, the only thing I said is, Assalamu alaikum. And he looked at me, he said, Mahala. He said, Lafia. I said, Nima tafiine. He said, Bismillah, Bismillah, Bismillah. He said, I should, I should sit. Bismillah. So he told me he was he was eating his gara garo. He said, Mahalan, Bismillah, get okay chokeli, much abunchi. Sir, we finished. He said, Mahalan, he said, Masalachin na muki kwana. Sir, in case seko seko kwanta. Sir, I slept in the mosque. In the morning, before the early morning prayers, before he knows that it is not, I only say salamu alaikum. <laughs> I quickly step out sir is it with that kind of christianity we will, is that, we, are you are you thinking we can we can dismantle that force our self-centered self-seeking self-glorifying christianity a christianity that only thinks about himself assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters here i've seen how um christian priest from Nigeria he said how he loves the Muslim Brotherhood and how he loves the Muslim hospitality and wherever you go Islam doesn't have any sort of racism any sort of like division for nationality and all these things Kullu Muslimun ikhwa, all the Muslims are brothers so if you come from Nigeria or USA or Canada or Australia or India Pakistan Bangladesh or like Central Asian countries, wherever you are, if you are a Muslim, if you share the kalima la ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, then you are brothers. In the masjid, all the Muslims, no matter how rich or how poor he is, all are same. Everyone has the same right in the masjid. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala judges you with your taqwa, with your good deeds. The more God consciousness you have, the more good deeds you do, the better you are. Other than that, all of us are same. So, you can see in the Western countries, Islam is the fastest growing religion. We have only one divine book that is Al-Quran, which is preserved for last 1400 years 
not a single verse is changed it's all the same you take a quran from usa and you take a quran from saudi arabia it's all same and that is one of the biggest miracles of islam may allah give us the true understanding of the quran may allah give us the true guidance and may allah keep us steadfast on this deen guys this was amazing but let me go back to the table of battle spill i feel christians some christians like i don't know but the love isn't there i can remember i think this was like eight years ago when my that day i can remember when class then my teacher was actually teaching us about paul yes i think i was staying junior high he was teaching us about paul and like the full term was just about paul then he was teaching us about the great deed he did and concerning the christian the great deed he did for christians and him trying to build the church stuff like that but he was like if he wants to be honest if you want to like check based on religion like uh, muslims actually care like they actually that love is there for their brother more than the way we christians actually love our brothers or oh, I, I i was still say there's some christians because i feel me as a person if i know you even if i don't know you and i have a means of helping you i will that's just it that's me and i feel there are lots of me out there that christians well it's beautiful like i feel the goal is for you to actually be a good person that that's it like we all want this world to be a better place and i feel we can start it by us ourselves being better guys go to the end of this video guys this was an amazing video i can say like this actually will make you see the good days someone is doing and you want to do something like that it's just beautiful that is why i feel i'm going to putting out amazing videos like this out there guys i'll see you next time guys best